I know that if I dig deeply enough, no matter who the person is, I'll find something rotten. Mary Sawyer is probably one of the three biggest box office attractions in America, right? Right. She's played everything from Joan of Arc to uh, the Song of Faith. In the minds of the American public, she's practically a nun, right? Right. It's a dead end, Chief. I don't believe it. There's something dirty in everyone's past. And Mary Sawyer is no exception. The cleaner they are on the surface, the dirtier they are underneath. Well, there, there is this guy, Scott Martin. Who? Scott Martin. He's a guy around town that works with puppets. Scott Martin and his puppets were the TV idols of millions of kids. He was the perfect target for the slander boys. A celebrity very much in the limelight, in love with a wonderful girl, and there was something in his past. You mean to say this man trades in these things? He's willing to kill the story on me if I give him some dope on Mary Sawyer? Sounds like a real nice guy. What is this stuff about Mary Sawyer that he wants to know? It doesn't matter. Well, it matters a lot to Manley. He's in the business of destroying people. I'm not. You know his magazine. Who would be hurt more, Scott? Mary Sawyer, a big star who's already made her pile? Or Scott Martin, a guy who's on the verge of making this? I don't want to feel ashamed of my son. I want to feel Mother, proud of him. You have no reason to be ashamed. I'm giving the, the people of this country something that... Something they not only want, but something they need. I'm giving them the truth. Every month, more than five million of them walk up to their newsstands. They come because they want what I have to sell. That same argument could be advanced by the people who sell opium to the Chinese peasants. You don't look like dirt. You look like someone a kid ought to get up for when you come into a room. You've got the whole country sitting on the edge of a cliff, holding their breath, waiting to see who's the next victim you'll shove over. Mr. Martin. I'd like to tell you how... 